Hi there, my Linux friends. Welcome to the DistroWatch Linux distributions of January 2016. Hey, but wait a minute, 2016 just started, man. And the other day, you already made a kind of review uh, about some systems that were uh, new in December. Yeah, but you know what? I just took a look and what did I discover? I discovered that we had some new things coming up on the first oh wait a minute no we had on the 4th of uh, January we got Ubuntu Mate and Ubuntu Mate is back with their version 16 LTS launch in April oh wait a minute uh, three Ubuntu community editions have launched new development releases in pre preparations for their stable 1606 launch in April okay the new test images which carry the designation 1604 alpha 1 are available for Ubuntu Mate, Kylin and Lubuntu so ladies and gentlemen look what we have here we got the surprise from our friends from Ubuntu and there it is um, yeah on the 4th of January 2016 we have this new version of Ubuntu. Well, it's, yeah, as they said, in alpha stage. So, uh, yeah, in April, we will be uh, surprised with uh, version number 16. So we're gonna wait until then or start downloading this and test it out. It's uh, eight nice. I love uh, the classic looks of it. But if you take a better look at the icons, you see that they use very, very beautiful icons. Uh, the folders can be I think the 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 fonts yeah you guys must work on the fonts okay but for the rest and maybe the, these folders try to give them some color red orange crazy colors yellow green make it more colorful it's a little bit dark but it looks good well done there my friends well done let me see who the makers are so we can also give them a little bit of credits because these guys work 24-7 they are waste they're not wasting their time sitting on Facebook doing nothing these guys are busy creating and the 4M Linux project um, has started the new year of 4M Linux 15 for 4M Linux project produce a small size independently developed multi-purpose distribution the new 15 release features mostly software updates for M Linux 15 stable release the stable uh, oh my gosh where was I the status of the now includes GNUC library 2.2.2 uh, 2.22 as a response to the request for 4 M Linux users the following applications I, I'm trying to, to look for a name here but I don't see no name guys come on you do a lot of work you put a lot of effort in this thing you know put your name out there we want to know who you are so we can credit you man and I'm surely gonna test this uh, this here because I love the size of the ISO it's 400 megabyte and I still have a bunch of empty uh, CDs so I'm surely gonna burn one of these a new one in the list ladies and gentlemen man is seduction seduction very nice name happy new year I like that I like that already Happy New Year! The first release announcement of the year 2016 is from the developers of Seduction, a set of Linux distributions based on Debian's unstable branch who have released uh, initial development build of the products 15.10. 15.1.0. The release includes Cinnamon LXQT made a new addition and XFCE flavors. Fantastic! With KDE Plasma, GNOME or LXQT. Not quite ready yet, although they should be available within a day or two. You see these guys work their balls off to get things, you know, finished. I think it's already on the site. As you can see, the downloads are already here. You need a DVD to, uh, to try this out because you cannot burn a CD. 
because the smallest uh, is uh, 936 megabytes so let's take a look at the desktop wow wow look at that look at that let me take a look at that I love the start menu you see they work at least on something uh, kind of unique you don't see this like in every Linux distribution they did something about it uh, I love the blue orange and red here this looks really nice although you know we already know these colors from the shut off buttons um, the tag this also looks really nice eh? this looks nice although I'm a fan of uh, having it on top so I'm sure that we can also put this on top it's always possible with Linux so yeah well done and welcome to the club uh, my friends from Sediction uh, very nice build and we will surely uh, download it uh, very soon so we can make a review for our subscribers and Linux friends cause our last uh, Linux video has been watched over 300 times and it got over 13 likes so thank you for that uh, my friends at least uh, you like uh, what we are doing and yeah the group will get bigger and bigger and um, I was a kind of little fast so I'm gonna go back and introduce this a little bit more decent because we are at six minutes seven minutes now by going back and not doing anything to the page it will go back to where we were I hope yeah so there we are and we're gonna take a look at um, Calculate Linux ladies and gentlemen and the developers of Calculate Linux a gentle based uh, desktop and server distribution have announced the release of Calculate Linux 15.12 one of the main changes in this release is the replacements of the Chromium web browser with Cubezilla. we are happy to announce the release of Calculate Linux 15.12 so let's take a look at Calculate Linux and Calculate Linux looks nice I love the I love the start menu this looks a little bit old-fashioned but it looks stable it looks stable and it looks nice at the same time eh? I love I love the fact that you put uh, the 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 uh, the menu bar at top on the top because I always put it on top as well and uh, yeah I think only here you must do something with this but it looks good maybe you should not make it gray make it black or so you know play with it a little bit and 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 keep using them colorful icons well done guys welcome to the club I like it I like what I see calculate Linux in fact I I think I never showed it before I it was never in in one of our reviews so fantastic that we can show it today and uh, well we continue the list and I think that um, we already come to the end a little bit uh, we come to deepen Linux we already took uh, a look at deepen Linux the other uh, day uh, we can take a look at it again this was uh, uh, delivered on the 31st of uh, December so on all TS Eve these guys still brought this you know online so yeah let's give them a little bit credit eh? let's give them some love so they also see that they did not work for nothing and you see no start menu or no nothing eh? so this is yeah uh, in fact only thing that you see is uh, a beautiful very beautiful colored duck and uh, hey wasn't deep on Linux something in Chinese the other day that these guys do something about it is this a, a kind of international version now I'm not even sure let's take a look at that get me back to that little page my friends yeah you see that this is from my Korean friends eh? you see that languages supported uh, are up to 30 Wow look at that they did it oh I'm so proud of you uh, my friends uh, Malay Swedish Croatian Japanese Finnish Hindi Wow 
my Indian friends are gonna be really happy. Ukraine, besides we have reached an important cooperative relationship with Intel. Wow, good work there, you guys. We will uh, collaboratively utilize crosswalk uh, project to migrate existing web applications to deepen Linux. Well, I'm very proud of you there, my friends. We must take a look now into Deepin Linux because the other time we could not because it was only in Chinese, remember? So, uh, good job there, my friends. And uh, well done there that you work with Intel together now. We look at uh, my friends from Manjaro and I did not even see when they released it. We're going to take a look at that in a second because it takes a little bit long. Hey, but Manjaro, hey, I, I see changes, y'all. I see changes. I see. What do I see? I see beautiful. I see everything looks so nice. What is this with you guys, yo? And girls. Wow. I like what I'm seeing here. Very nice done. So let's read a little bit uh, uh, about it. Because we're already reaching uh, 15 minutes here, my friends. We cannot go over that. Uh, we must keep uh, to that of the bosses of channel 48 we are not allowed to make longer videos but uh, the manjaro linux project has announced availability when was it created first thing when was it created when was this released this was released on the 31st of december these guys also worked really hard to get this done before the end of the year so congratulations there my friends well done and a uh, uber student oh my gosh that is a new one in the list i never saw before welcome uber student wow look at that i love it already look at the powerful background saying hey guys take a look at this eh? take a look at this this is milestone look at the colors they used i love it you guys are really and girls are really listening i'm so proud of you proud proud i am of you there working on these new distributions and i'm not gonna say it any louder we are almost reaching 12 minutes 30 seconds my friends and uh, yeah i i i must uh, give stephen even uh, a little credit there and i must take a quick look it's three gigabyte we we, we sure gonna do something with that the last one we're gonna take a look at and i see that we still had some to go oh my gosh i'm not reaching it with time 13 minutes is a soulless project we didn't see soulless yet we didn't see uh, x key yet we didn't see oh yeah i think susa we saw susa we saw but uh i think we ended with susa and antics remember antics and manjaro you see so hard manjaro worked so i think in this last minute we can take a quick peek at x key and wow also very nice i love this mm, beautiful beautiful i'm gonna put a link to this uh to this uh, uh site so you can all come and and take a, a a better look at it and even download your 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 flavor that you would like to have to uh, so go ahead and do that um yeah i wanted to show the uber student desktop real fast where is it uh so the, what was it solus project what was it where is it i think it yeah it, i think it was solus project and then we must really stop oh no we already had this one yo peeps i'm out of time i want to thank you so much for watching and for liking and for you know uh being there with us you know also not so uh yeah fantastic linux knowers but uh in the first place big enthusiasts that uh really uh love to you know share and and give credits of course oh my god look, look at, at, this. at this wow this is really fantastic it's called Solus Linux and this is the last one we're gonna look at peeps because uh we have a last minute to go here and we see that Solus is one of the most i think Solus got the first prize uh in this uh in this uh, video today of the desktops they worked really hard and it looks really fantastic well done guys and uh, i say till my next video like subscribe and let me know what you think